One of the most important parts of the Mac OS operating systems is this little area down here at the bottom of the screen, which is known as the dock. In this area is the place where you're going to find the icons about the programs that are very quick to launch, as well as the programs that are actually running right now. If you don't like the size of the dock, you can actually put your mouse cursor over top of one of these vertical black bars, this one or this one, and you can make this as, well, not quite as big as you want, but you can make it quite large and you can make it really quite unpleasantly small. So I'm going to pick it for the size right here, simply for the purpose of the recording. The dock itself is divided into three areas. We have the stuff here, the first part before the vertical bar. We have the stuff in the middle between the two vertical bars and we have the stuff at the end. The stuff on the left hand side are the applications which have been pinned to the dock. Actually what it is, it's an operation called kept in dock. Uh, so these are programs that I can very quickly start up in, uh, well I can start up by simply clicking on. For example, right here I've got the calendar. So if I want to start the calendar because it's here in the dock, I don't have to go look anywhere for it. I just have to click on the button. Okay, so we'll close this one up. The next set of the next set of icons in the dock are the programs that are currently running. For example, I have something called VMware Fusion, which is currently running. Okay, I won't need to explain this one. I've got this little program here called RStudio. This is actually part of the uh, web page for the document that we've been looking at. So I'll put this away. And QuickTime is running, and so is Microsoft Word, which is the thing that I'm reading from right now. Uh, QuickTime, of course, is running because that's what I'm using to record this screen. So that's the second area. So these are programs that are currently running that are not normally kept in the dock for quick access. The third section of the dock is a set of files. So we'll notice here that we've got the area called download. So everything that you download from the internet usually ends up in here and you can click on it and you can get a list of all the files and you can see I've got a file, I've got a zip file and a folder that I've downloaded for some purpose. I've also got the trash can in here, which is going to be used for removing files a little bit later. And you'll notice that this RStudio is also here. What these are, these are programs that I've minimized. For example, we've minimized this one. If I was to open up, say, Google Chrome, give me a second because I've got an extra screen here. Let me drag this over. And if I was to minimize Google Chrome at this point, you'll see now I've got an extra icon over here that I can bring back at any time. 